the upcoming 2024 2 high air show will in spotlight one of China's most advanced missile defense systems, the HQ-19. Known as the Hongqi-19, this Chinese-developed anti-ballistic missile system already operational with the People's Liberation Army efforts, is making its first public appearance. The HQ-19 is an advanced system designed to engage ballistic missile threats within and beyond the atmosphere. Comparable to the US THAADER, the HQ-19 represents a significant advancement in China's missile defense capabilities with implications for our regional and global security. The HQ-19 is mounted on a high-mobility 8x8 truck and features a six-missile launcher configuration, employing a cold launch mechanism with a steep launch angle. The system is engineered for precision for intercepting incoming ballistic missiles. A key component of the HQ-19's targeting and tracking is the 610A information radar, which provides long-range detection up to approximately 4,000 km. This range covers critical regions such as North and South Asia and extends to areas within China, including the Tibetan Plateau, allowing it to detect and intercept a range of regional threats. The HQ-19's guidance system is highly sophisticated, utilizing an infrasticker designed with side windows that reduce atmospheric interference for improved accuracy at high altitudes. Its two-stage solid rocket engine, powered by the N15 solid propellant and reinforced with carbon fiber construction, offers a specific impulse of 260 seconds. This advanced engine enables the missile to maintain high maneuverability and rapid response with maneuver forces reaching up to 60 g. Additionally, the HQ-19 features a double pulse model design that enhances its terminal kinetic care of fitness improving interception accuracy and extending its operational range. The HQ-19 is among a select group of global systems that employ kinetic care technology, a method first mastered by the United States with its kinetic care vehicles. China achieved its first successful kinetic care test flight in 1999, positioning it as the second country to reach this technological milestone. The HQ-19's intercept range of up to 3,000 km enables it to engage various ballistic missile types, including re-entry warhead. This system's ability to conduct successful high-altitude interceptions at speeds reaching 10,000 meters per second solidifies its status as one of the most advanced missile defense technologies globally. Since 2010, China has conducted several HQ-19 tests, with the most recent notable trial in February 2021, affirming the system's operational reliability. The Ministry of National Defense emphasized that these tests serve defensive purposes, underscoring the HQ-19's role in bolstering national security rather than posing a threat to any specific country. Such trials demonstrate the HQ-19's potential as a robust deterrent against ballistic missile attacks. Already deployed by the People's Liberation Army efforts, the HQ-19 plays a critical role in China's layered missile defense network, providing a middle layer between systems like the HQ-9, which targets medium-range threats, and the HQ-26, designed for extended-range, high-altitude interceptions. 
The HQ-19 is a core component of China's ballistic missile defense strategy, positioned as a countermeasure against advanced regional missile systems, including India's Agni-4 and Agni-5 missiles. By integrating phase array radar with its layer defense systems, the HQ-19 is part of a broader network aimed at providing early warning, tracking, and intercept capabilities. This multi-layer approach allows China to address a wide spectrum of ballistic missile threats, enhancing its capacity to respond to shifting regional power dynamics and military advancements in Asia. The HQ-19's debut at the Zhuhai Air Show is seen as a potential signal that the system may be available for export, targeting regions where ballistic missile threats are growing concern. Potential customers in the Middle East, such as Saudi Arabia and Egypt, may find the HQ-19 appealing for their defense needs. By expanding its missile defense system's export reach, China aims to build stronger bilateral defense relationships and meet the security demands of emerging markets beyond its core allies. This approach aligns with China's strategy of using defense exports to bolster its global influence, aiming to increase its presence in markets traditionally dominated by the US and Russia. The HQ-19's entry into the global arms market could reshape defense dynamics as countries where China's advanced missile defense technology as a viable alternative to Western systems like THAAD or Russia's S-400. In the context of modern warfare, the HQ-19 enhances China's ability to protect strategic assets and population centers against increasingly sophisticated missile threats. As regional tensions, particularly in East and South Asia, drive an arms race in advanced ballistic and hypersonic missile capabilities, China's HQ-19 provides a critical layer of defense against potential threats. Its interception range and precision make it a formidable tool in defending against short to intermediate range missiles adding resilience to China's military posture. Looking ahead, the HQ-19's integration into China's larger missile defense network, including the anticipated HQ-26 system, suggests an evolving defense strategy. Together, these systems from a comprehensive shield against a wide range of ballistic threats, reinforcing China's position in an era of growing geopolitical competition. <laughs>